Hey everybody, welcome to workout number five. This is your first leg day. What we're going to do is take your leg exercises from your past workouts and put them together, uh, minus your plie squat, in a sequence of exercises so it'll be easy for you to get through them. I'm going to be using tens today. I need to build up my legs. I uh, genetically do not have the most shapely legs and glutes, so I'm going to bring my weight up. Feel free to add some weight. Um, you know, to certain exercises that you didn't do before or bring the weight up if you feel you're ready. So, first exercise we're going to do is our standing lunge that we did in workout one. Um, we didn't use weight last time. Today I will be using weight and try to add some weight if you can. So, we're going to go one set of these. You're doing three sets total like usual, but I'm going to be just showing you one set today. And remember, push from the heel. Breathe out when you go up. And up, go five, four, three, two, and switch. Great, and switch legs, remember, oh, oh, hello! <laughs> and keep that heel down, push two, three, breathe, four, five, six, seven, core in tight, eight, nine, I'm just going 15, so feel free to move past that if you can. With added weight, you can stick around the 15 rep range and relax. So, that's going to be your first exercise for your leg day. Next, we're going to go into our deadlifts, which we did uh, workout two, I believe. Uh, grab those weights and come down, butt back, abs in tight. Butt back, head up, squeeze your butt at the top. I'm sorry, it was workout three. I remember now, <laughs> I couldn't walk from them. <laughs> Abs in tight, squeeze at the top. Stretch, if you need more of a rest in between sets, go ahead, but uh, with the weight we're using right now, you can usually move right along. Stretch down, squeeze, stretch, squeeze your butt at the top, remember core in tight, lift with your core, squeeze your butt, butt back, and let's go one more, and squeeze your butt. Great. <clears throat> Next exercise we're going to do is your squat with your arms to your side. So feet a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. And we're going to squat down. Breathe out when you come up. Back up a little bit so I'm not so in your face. Chest up. Let's get a profile. Butt back. And breathe out. Butt back, chest up. Butt back. Good, keep going. Let's go five. Push, four, push, three, butt back, two, and last one. Great, so that's your third leg exercise. Your fourth is going to be dumbbells on your shoulders. Same thing, squat, a little wider than that. And we're going to squat, butt back. Breathe out when you go up. Breathe in, breathe out. Profile view, sit, butt back. And push chest up, <clears throat> up, and up, sit, and push. So bring those weights up if you can, okay? Just time to excel, and push. Let's go two more, push, and one more. Great job. Woohoo! So your next exercise is going to be the walking lunges. Let's add some weight to this as well. Tens may be a little heavy for some of you, so you can bring that weight down, but I'm gonna be using tens today. Big step, and turn it. Breathe. Good, I'm really gonna be winded today. Usually I'm during legs, <laughs> but endurance is getting better. How's everyone's cardio going? I'm doing mine. And breathe. Hold it right to your side, walk a tightrope. That's what my uh, old boss, Jason Young, used to tell me, walk a tightrope, and sit, push, turn back around, big step, make sure your knee doesn't go over your toe, back, breathe, and push, remember three sets, so repeat this two more times, sit, push, bring it back around, sit, and sit, 
Good, bring it back around. Sit, push, sit. And I'm gonna go one more and feel free to continue. And push, great. All right, so that is five leg exercises I'd like you to repeat three times, okay? We're going to do different kind of plyo today using more of our upper body, still using our legs, uh, but definitely targeting your upper body as well. So it's called a mountain climber. You're gonna come down and you're gonna switch those legs. Breathe, this should be interesting how I can talk after this because this one will knock the wind right out of you. Breathe. Come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Next, I call the ground out and in. So just be careful with your feet. Uh, make sure you don't have any aching in your feet uh, after you do this. So basically same stance and you're just going out and in, not too wide, just babies. You want those knees twisting in. Good. I hate to give you a back view of this, but we'll give you a diagonal. <laughs> Good. Breathe. Go. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay? So that's your second plyo exercise. Your third is just going to be jumps. We're going to work those calves a little bit, like a jump rope. I always push this one to about 30. Good. Keep going. 10, 9, 7, 6, 5, 4, 2, 1. And one more plyo exercise. Heel touches. Touch those heels. Get that heart rate up. Breathe. Come on. Move those arms. Keep going. Let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Great. So you have your leg exercises to repeat two more times. Woo. And also your plyometric exercises to repeat two more times. On the ground for some abs. Uh, sorry your abs got uh, cut off the last workout. I don't know what the heck happened, so that's my explanation. Um, hook your feet if you can. If you can, try to keep them stationed. These are called halfbacks. This was on your last uh, workout. So just go half back, keeping your abs strong. Pause when you're down and up. Reach your arms if you need to. Pause. Pause. Breathe out when you come up. Pause. Let's go five more. Five, come on, keep going, you got it. Four. Three. Pause. Two. And one. Awesome. <laughs> uh, last time we did jackknives down the middle. Today we're going to do our sides. So hit those obliques more. Also hitting your hip flexor. So move those legs to the side. Breathe out when you go in. Profile. And pull. Go 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, switch. Oh, my hair looks real cute today, I see. Should be interesting. Other side. Pull in, breathe out. And pull. Pull, pull, breathe, and pull, pull, 10 more, go 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1, great, and we're going to hit those hip flexors again, I know they're going to be tired from your legs, but let's keep it working, okay, so on your back, instead of a flutter kick, we're just going to hold, and hold, breathe. I know you guys did this, these in school growing up. And I'm assuming you probably didn't like them. <laughs> but we love them now. They're so effective. So hold. And breathe. Keep going. Breathe. Go 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Not too high, not too low. 3, two, 
and one. Great. Good. Hate to move you along too fast, uh, but wanted to get this workout to you um, as soon as possible. So there are your workouts. Repeat it two more times, and next week we will have four workouts to do. We only did two this week. Wanted you to get that cardio in. Next week we're going to cut down on cardio and uh, add another day of weight training. So that'll be exciting. Uh, after you, you do your leg routine, take the next day off. Let those babies recover. All right, thanks so much, guys, and I'll see you next week. Mwah!